Alrighty, so today what we are gonna do is we are gonna test out the Cobalt 24 volt hacksaw. Now, I bought this thing uh, a little while ago. I have not tested this out yet. This thing is uh, seriously awesome. It is pretty compact. If you compare it to the uh, DeWalt Atomic, it is a little bit longer and a little bit fatter. So the everyone hates the DeWalt Atomic, especially the DeWalt fans. So we are gonna do a versus video in the future between these two. But today we are gonna test out the Cobalt Brushless Hacksaw. All right, so the Cobalt Brushless Hacksaw, 24 volt system. So the model number for this is KRS124B-03. It is 3,000 strokes per minute. And I'll put the stroke, the stroke length in right now. It seems like a pretty decent stroke length. So, but we are gonna see what power this has. So I still have the brand new Cobalt Blade. So I'm glad I saved that. We're gonna try the six inch metal blade. We are gonna cut metal in this uh, in this episode, see how well it does. So this is by metal. Uh, the Cobalt is six teeth per inch. The Avanti, I hope I could, yep. The Avanti is 10 and 18 teeth per inch. So we have a two uh, amp hour battery and a four amp hour battery. We are gonna see if there's a time difference between the two and the four. So let's bring out the wood and get the metal out. Remember every time you work, wear gloves and safety glasses. All right, so is this an easy installation? Yes, it is. There you go, done. All right, we have a two amp hour battery. The battery is full. Uh, first, we're gonna uh, do this without nails. So let's see what it can naturally do. All right, so. Ready, go. Time. It's not bad, not bad at all. Let's do one more. Ready, go. Let's switch batteries out. Let's see if there is a little time difference between the two and the four. Ready, go. All right, let's do one more. So ready, go. Not bad, not bad at all. All right, let's put a little, this through a little bit more stress. Let's put some nails in it. Sorry, we're gonna put some three, three screws in. Oh, sorry. There we go. This little 12 volt guy is powerful. All right, and the last thing what we gotta do is mark it with this and where they pretty much stop. Let's see about right there is the end point of those screws. All right, so ready, go. That blade, lost some teeth on the blade. I lost one tooth. Lost one tooth on that blade. All right, so ready? Go. blade is not lasting too long. We are going to see on how well it goes with this semi-used metal, uh, wood metal Avanti blade, the newer cobalt blade. 
All right, so ready, go. Time. Teeth are a little worn out, but that's all right. All right, let's do one more. Let's do one more. With a 4 amp hour battery, battery is still full. Alright, so let's actually cut this out all the way. Ready? Go. That wood is smoking. All right, let's continue. Time. Now remember, this is also a stress test on the motor of the cobalt. This is not only how fast can it do. We're doing a stress test. All right, so let's try this brand new wood only blade. Go beyond the marker. All right, so. Four amp hour battery, ready, go. Time. Right, let's do a two amp hour battery. All right, so ready, go. Time. Let's do a temperature reading really quick. 75, battery is full. Let's see what happens. All right, so ready, go. It cut on a little slant too. It did not cut straight. But there you go. What's the battery life on that? The three bars. One inch black steel pipe. We're gonna do it with the, this is at two bars, which that should be plenty of, of battery. All right, so ready? Love burning metal in the morning. All right, let's put the four amp hour in. Let's see what this can do. Ready? Go. Alrighty, we're gonna do one more blade. Brand new blade, six inch metal. Six inch metal blade. All right, so ready, go. Time. That's not bad. I mean, it did the job. Now, this is really, 
This is it does not smell burning. Same thing, 100 about 124. I mean, it's it's really not bad. It's a, it's a good tool, but it, for doing the tasks in this video, this got really really warm. This did perform the way it's supposed to. Now, well, when it comes to the overworking it, I it, this got warm really fast. Now, when it comes to a previous video when I used a hacksaw for a job that it normally isn't designed for. That, that got uh, hot as well, but it kept on going. Uh, in the future, we are going to do a major stress test on this to see what this can do. But I need more blades because I don't want to just continuously use dull blades. Uh, I want to use good blades and see how long those last as well in a future video. Cobalt is to Lowe's like Ryobi is to Home Depot. It's a good economic uh, brand uh, at a good price. Brushless tools. And so, yes, we are going to be doing more cobalt tools. I just got the hammer drill. We're going to do versus videos with those along with other cobalt tools that I'm going to get. So that's pretty much it. This is Dave Nicholas. Thank you for tuning in. I'll see you guys next time.